Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our first plug-in hybrid electric vehicle for China, the C-MAX Energy. Our approach at Ford is straightforward because we're disrupting ourselves and expanding our business model. Simply put, we're moving from being an auto company to an auto and a mobility company in one of the most dramatic shifts in our 113 year history. Ford Sync has become the world's leading in vehicle entertainment and communication system. And now we're going further with the launch of Sync 3, our most advanced version yet. Sync 3 is faster, it's more intuitive, and it's even easier to use than our previous generation system. Ford Pass reimagines the entire customer experience and aims to do for car owners what iTunes did for the music fans. So let's turn to autonomous vehicles, which is another important part of our Ford Smart Mobility Plan. We're in the process of taking another big step forward by tripling the size of our test fleet to 30 fully autonomous fusion hybrid sedans. And by the end of this year, we will have the largest autonomous vehicle fleet of any automaker. A key area where Ford is playing to win is one of the fastest growing segments in the market, SUVs. We are very proud of our global SUV heritage. And today, we have a comprehensive range of SUVs in many markets around the world, including EcoSport, Kuga, Edge, Everest, and Explore. And tonight, we are very excited to introduce the next chapter in our SUV story. Ladies and gentlemen, a vehicle that turns everyday journeys into modern adventures the new Ford Kuga. Now, this vehicle is new inside and out. Its bold, sporty exterior design features the new face of Ford, which instantly links it to the Ford SUV family. Ladies and gentlemen, the all-new Ford F-150 Raptor. So this is a vehicle that can go anywhere at any time, and now for the first time ever, it's coming to China. <laughs> 